of you have some time and energy to give today, go to the Mission Houses Museum Cafe and Tea Parlor, where you can help to make a thousand cranes to send to the people of Japan affected by the earthquake and tsunami. It's called Flock of Prayers. If you donate at least a dollar, which goes to the American Red Cross, you will get to send a crane that you can make and send a message. Joining us this morning is the event organizer, Appa Yeshiro, and one of her faithful supporters, Ricky Lee. Thanks for getting up so early in the morning. Appa, first of all, tell us what your group is doing. Um, our group is making, um, our goal is to make a thousand cranes for, um, to send to Japan, to the children of Japan. And we're asking people to donate a dollar to the Red Cross for every crane, and they can personalize it with a message on the crane to send. Well, that's, that's a good fundraising mm -hmm. idea. Tell, for those who don't know, explain what the crane symbolizes in Japan. Um, in Japan, it's tradition to make a thousand cranes for anyone who's sick, and then um, they have their wish granted, and um, uh, usually it's up to a thousand cranes, and then um, they get better. And do you know exactly where you're going to be sending it to? Um, I've talked to my cousin who works at um, a preschool in Japan, so we're trying to send it over there. Okay, excellent. And so, Ricky, how, how are you involved in this? And are, have you made some of these cranes? And you oh. know, I tried, and boy, <laughs> mine are pretty, pretty ugly. Although but I, mean, I, made, <laughs> I made pterodactyls and not cranes. <laughs> but, um, uh, oh, I'm sorry, I forgot. No, the so, so how are you involved in this, and what oh, are you um, doing? I'm just the organizer. I made sure that we had a place to build the cranes, and I got other Twitter people involved in um, uh, building the cranes over the, over the week. Um, also, along with our building the cranes, we're also going to have artists and photographers selling their artwork at Mission Houses Museum today. So, if you can't fold the cranes, you can always, you know, donate by buying one of our artworks. So then, uh, the funds earned by selling what the artworks will be sent to, to Japan as well. Yes. yes. So all that, okay, and then that mm -hmm. will be going to the American Red Cross. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. And so, how many cranes have you made so far? This is at near a thousand. <laughs> oh, uh, current count was about 400 this morning. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah. Okay, so you want to make at least 600 today. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then are you going to be putting it into a, a frame? Uh, how do you, you, do you design it in a certain way before you send it off, or do you just send them loose well, uh, 1,000 grains? According to tr tr tradition, we're supposed to string them together, so we'll try to do that. <laughs> okay. But uh, we're not 100% sure. It depends on how we are, we're allowed to ship it to Japan. Right. Okay, yeah. sure. And how mm -hmm. long did it, is it, has it taken you to, to make uh, 400 grains? Well, we've been getting together for a couple of weeks already, and um, a lot of Twitter people have been helping at cafes um, during the mm -hmm. evenings, and it's be taken about maybe a couple days. Okay. So yeah. We really okay. appreciate all of the support that yeah. everyone's been giving us. And one more time, where and when? Uh, Mission House's uh, Museum uh, Cafe, Cafe and Tea Parlor, <laughs> <laughs> 12 to 4 today. Okay. Yeah. Good luck to you. Thank, Thank you, you for so joining much. us.